Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to look into how to attend an online class using Google Meet and G Suite account. So first we have to download Google Meet. For that, we'll go to Play Store. In it, we are going to type Google Meet. So the first link is Google Meet. So we will just click on it. Now uh, this is the one, uh, this is the application that we need to install in order to get started. So now it has already been installed on my phone. So that's why it's showing me update or uninstall. But in your case, if you're installing it for the first time, it will show install. So once the installation is done, we have to go uh, to our meet. Now in here, we have to set up our G Suite account and only then we can um, attend a G Suite meeting, a G Suite online class that is being conducted. For that, we'll go over to the top left corner, the three bars that are given. So we'll go there and then we will press that small uh, arrow and we will go to add another account. So in here, we have to set up our G Suite account. So it is going to ask for a pattern lock. So we'll gonna do that. So in here, we are going to uh, type in our G Suite account ID. So in my case, it is. Next, we are going to type in our password. So once uh, the account password is correct, so it will um, ask for all the disclaimers and everything. So we'll just simply agree on it. Then it will verify our account. Now, once it has been done, uh, all the accounts will be listed in here. So now we have to switch the account, go to manage account on this device. We'll press Google. So as you can see, uh, my account t.1856, uh, the G Suite ID has been added. So we'll press on it. So it's showing. So uh, in here, uh, if you have made an accidental account, you can uh, even uh, remove that account. That option is also available. So we are not going to remove it. We'll go back. So now, uh, because of that process of managing account, our new uh, Google ID, G Suite ID account has been added, T.1856. So we are going to select this. Now uh, it is written that signed in as T.1856. This is important. Only if we do that, it we will be able uh, to access an online class uh, else we won't be able to access an online class that is being conducted within the G Suite accounts because uh, your school is having a G Suite account and you are also having a G Suite account. So only, in, uh, only if you have activated the G Suite account in your Google Meet, only then it will allow you to join a meeting from your school. So now what we are going to do, uh, we will find the link for joining the Google Meet. So all of the link will be posted by your respective teachers into Google Classroom. So we'll go to Google Classroom or even uh, some of the teachers will share it via WhatsApp. The process is more or less same. So in my case, uh, I'll uh, go into class 12 CS. So let me press on it. So in here, uh, one of the notification is given that we are going to have an uh, online class on Monday. So we'll just press on it. So here uh, on the attachment part, we have a link for Google meeting, right? So what we are going to do, we'll just simply tap on it. Now, as we have set up uh, the account over here, so uh, this was important. If we didn't do that and we just simply try and join a meeting which is being conducted within the G Suite accounts, we won't be able to do that. So we have to make sure that it is right. So it is written T.1856. So now all we have to do is just simply click on join meeting. 
now as it is just for the demonstration and this meeting is supposed to be held on the next day uh, nobody will be here at present as you can see no one is there uh, only your screen is active now when a teacher will be presenting his or her class what we have to do we have to pin that particular uh, person else what will happen whoever talks in between the class because a class will have like what 40 students and a teacher so whichever student talks for anything you know, his or her screen will get activated so the best way to tackle this problem is to pin your teacher screen so there is a pin uh, a board pin like structure so all you have to do is just tap on it and it will be done now in it we have three options uh, the middle one is for disconnecting the call the first one on the right uh, is for the camera so if you want to disable your camera it is doable so if i just simply press on it my camera gets disabled only an icon is being shown now even if i want to disable my microphone and at certain times it is advisable as uh, it will reduce the background noise in the classes so we can also disable our microphone that will also work right and uh, whenever we need to enable like we want to ask a question we can just simply enable the microphone and we are gonna be good so now once it is it has been done our session our online class is has ended what we are going to do we will simply terminate the call right and it will uh, show that okay mm, uh, if you want we can uh, rejoin it or present so uh, students are not going to present only the teacher will present right so this was how we are online class using google meet and our g suit id uh, so uh, stay uh, tuned to the channel subscribe and thanks for watching